When I think about Community Television Network, I think about the, uh, the aspect of people being able to just go on the air to really exercise their free speech. An opportunity for any person in a community to have access to, to expressing an idea is critical. The fact that it exists whatsoever provides such an amazing opportunity. I mean, I, I've gone to a little bit of film school and I know a lot of other students here have, but there's something about the hands-on experience you can get from just walking in the studio and just saying, can I start working on something? And them saying, yes, Here's, you can work on this project, this. You can start your own project. We'll give you the tools. It's, it's really amazing. I, I find that it's really satisfying to sort of help people get involved in community media um, because it's a resource not too many people know about. But it's important because it's a way to get voices heard that aren't normally heard. It's pretty clear that community media is the only media outlet that outside of the internet proper, and even that's becoming increasingly less so, that is open format. Community media is uh, very valuable, uh, especially these days with big corporate production companies and, and broadcast media. Um, it allows for a voice for people who don't have access to a lot of money. I'm also a media studies student, so I know that a lot of the stuff that you see on a, um, a network, for example, is mostly sponsored and someone in an office is deciding what the viewer sees. So you may see something that's all right wing, you might see something that's all left wing, but local access gives you a chance to say what's really happening on the ground. People have uh, the right to free speech, but rarely use it. For instance, if they have a issue on their street or in their neighborhood, they could come to CTN, uh, learn how to use uh, the video equipment, uh, find other people that use that, that do this, and go in and work on, on this issue, bring more visibility. To I think the topics that happen in this room are amazing. And um, I think about um, the gender dignity show in particular, like somebody has a, an interest and a motivation and they have a place to come to really take the topic to a broader range of people. It's really important, this medium, TV, um, it's about information, it's about being a citizen. It's not a popularity contest to get onto public access television, so anyone with an opinion can, can uh, explore it and uh, share it and maybe uh, have an influence or cause a ripple effect somewhere in the community conversation. Community television, it gives people a chance to like let their voices be heard. It gives them a chance to come up with their ideas and like share them. Community television is important because not only is it um, showing what is going on in our community and making sure that people are aware, but it also helps people from the community be able to learn about media and TV. The importance of community television has been, it's just been like a great outlet for my creativity and a great space to learn, a great environment to learn. I really wanted to be here to explore more options in film because I'd only really taken classes at school, but this was really like eye-opening and I got to see how productions come together, how they work, how to schedule them and then edit them all together and put them on the actual TV and it's really, it was a great experience and I'm glad I did it. I, I will advise everyone to come and give it a try. You will find nice people. People are very smart, intelligent. They know sound system, editing. Access gives a voice not only to issues and the things that are happening in the community, but artists that can come in, uh, dancing, uh, music. I think community media is important because it's vital in maintaining the functioning, in reflecting the voices of the community members back within itself. The community television is important because like, it gives everyone who's not like, able to, to get information like, directly, 
because they can watch the television and see what's going on in the community. Community and media, in terms of our community television network, it's a relatively free resource. Once you've learned the materials, the equipment, you're free to come and volunteer as much as you want to produce a show of your own. So I say use it. What I like here is a team effort and a team spirit. And that's more important than most of the other things that could be trapping you here and there. Yeah, the, the sense of community within the television station itself. We're humans. We like to get out there and connect. And I think just being able to use the media outlet and being able to go try and commu contact with your, co your community is very important. It's a very essential, actually.